Today, body cameras back up for discussion at KCPD. That's right, and we expect the chief to update police commissioners about the concept during their monthly meeting later today. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan joins us from police headquarters with a preview. Charlie. Lindsay and Taylor, right now, none of the officers who are here at the police headquarters or throughout the city actually wear body cameras. But the department has asked companies to submit kind of proposals to explain how much it would cost for the city to buy 1,000 body cameras and about 350 dashboard cameras to go in the squad cars. Those proposals are due in August, but we expect kind of an update from the chief today about that whole process. KCPD has been studying a body camera since about 2016. Other cities that use them say they increase transparency and help maintain evidence for investigators and prosecutors. But some of the challenges Kansas City face include how to store all those video files. They take up so much space and also how to pay for it. One city council member we spoke to said the city doesn't have that money in the budget right now, but there may be some federal funding available. Well, we expect Chief Rick Smith to give the Board of Police Commissioners an update on all of the generalities about these body cameras and this proposal during the Board of Police Commissioners meeting that happens at 930 today here inside the police headquarters. And it is a meeting that's open to the public, so you can go uh, sit in and even give your public comment. Reporting live in Kansas City, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.